today I want to go over how to add uh, a different background or to blur your background in Microsoft Teams. Uh, so you can see here I have Microsoft Teams installed on my MacBook. Um, and here I'm in the, in the Teams screen here. Uh, so starting a meeting and doing things in a meeting is a bit different than actually doing just a plain call. If you click on the tab here for calls, uh, this is more of a direct, uh, you know, one-to-one -one call thing. If you want to actually start a meeting, uh, you need to be in the Teams tab. And then if you look here down at the very bottom of, like, the conversation window here, uh, you'll see this little camera icon. If you mouse over that, it'll bring up a thing saying Meet Now. Now, in the free version of Teams, uh, which has been extended out to anyone with a Microsoft account, you can't schedule meetings. You can only do an ad hoc meeting. So um, this is where you will start the meeting uh, so you can change your background. So we'll start a meeting here. I'm not going to add a subject, I'm just going to say meet now. And then that'll pop up the meeting, start it right there. And then you'll see you can copy the link to the meeting or invite via email, kind of like Zoom or other uh, meeting applications. Uh, in this case, it's just Microsoft's version of that. So close out of that and you'll see yourself here on the screen. Uh, if you click on more actions, you'll see here show background effects, so click on that. And then here you can see there's nothing, you don't have any uh, any background on right now. If I want to blur the background, I click on that and click Apply. And there we go, it's blurred. Uh, Microsoft also supplies a whole bunch of different backgrounds from generic looking office locations to party balloons, you know, to uh, classroom, to robot factory, to I think locations from Halo and other games that Microsoft has sponsored or Minecraft. So you can be in any different number of locations for your meetings and it's that simple to turn them on. Once you have the, the preview set and you've clicked apply, just click on the X there and you'll be back to your main meeting screen and uh, wherever your virtual background of choice is will be turned on. All right, for Tech Republic, I'm Brandon Villarolo. Thanks for tuning in and stay tuned for more tips and tricks just like this one.